60 frequently asked questions about learning musical perfect pitch, ear training, and sight singing for young musicians, created and presented by Julia graduate David Liviano. Question 14. Do I need to solfege with Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Si, Do, or is it okay to solfege with Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Ti, Do? In late 19th century England, music teacher Sarah Glover changed the C note to T so that every syllable would begin with a different letter. Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Si, Do versus Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Ti, Do. In my opinion, singing with letter T is not as effective as using letter S. Why not use the original syllables established by Italian monk Guido d'Arezzo in the 11th century AD? Singing with Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Si, Do is the best way to learn to sight sing and sight read. Well, there's nothing wrong with using T instead of C for those students and teachers that are more comfortable and used to it. Whatever method you use, make sure you practice well, stay focused, and exercise consistently. A little bit every day is more effective to your musical development than three hours in one day and nothing for two weeks. For more information, questions, or comments, send an email to david at liviano.com. That's david at L as in Louis, I, V, Victory, I, A, N as in Nancy, U, dot com. David at liviano.com.